All right, today I'm gonna to show you to replace the starter motor on a 1998 Toyota Tacoma. The starter motor is actually here underneath the passenger side wheel well, right back there. Make sure that when you take the wheel off to get access to that starter motor behind the wheel well, that you support the truck at more than one point so you have a backup. We don't want any flat do-it-yourselfers out there. If you look at the replacement starter that I just bought, there's only two bolts that hold it in place right here on the bottom and then up here at the top as well. And when you're looking at it from the inside, you see that bottom bolt down there? It actually comes through the other side and screws into the starter motor. So there's nothing to ratchet off on this side. You just have to take the bolt out from the other end. So now I'm gonna go underneath and show you what the bolts look like coming into the back of the starter. But there's the wheel well coming underneath the truck and we got the transmission here. So the first bolt is gonna be this guy right here. It's a 14 millimeter. So undo that guy and then way up in there, right here, there's another 14 millimeter bolt that we're gonna take out as well. So I'm gonna unscrew both of those bolts, pull them out. This one's not gonna have room to pull out. So I'm just gonna bring it up, up until this bracket and then it should be unscrewed all the way from the other side. And then the starter motor has two connections on it. You can see this guy right there. I'm gonna take off this other side right here that's just clipped in that I just undo from the back side. To get a little more leverage with your wrenches, you can see it's up there attached to the bolt and I have two wrenches hooked together and I can move them like this. It'll give me an extra foot of leverage on that bolt so I can break it loose. So before I get too crazy disconnecting things on the starter, I'm gonna go ahead and remove the battery connection, the negative battery terminal, so it doesn't start sparking on me or anything when I'm working below it. And now that that's done, I've already popped off this little plastic piece. It was sitting just like this up underneath the starter on that little bolt right there. That's a 14 millimeter. So I'm gonna unscrew that and pop off that connection from the starter. And then there's one more connection on the other side that you can barely see. It just plugs right into this little plastic connection on the starter, so I'm going to undo that as well. That'll get rid of all the electrical components from the starter and allow me to pull it out from the transmission. There's a shot with it disconnected. Got that nut off and then the little wire just pops down off of that bottom part. The little plastic connection is down there with it as well. That's popped off the starter. Remember that if you try to do this with your vehicle hot, you're gonna have a bad time because these things are right up right next to the bolts. Now I've got those two bolts out from the sides of the starter. That hole for the starter is pretty worthless because the starter comes out better down here anyway. So I pulled it down out by the axle and that is it. So there we go. Now I'm gonna take the other starter put it back in next to the axle and try to mount that boy back into place. New starter is in place, bolted in, got the wire, two wire connections down at the bottom, all put in place. Make sure that you don't over tighten that bolt down at the bottom or that bottom connection will just twist right off and you'll have to get back in there and attach a new starter. So make sure you don't over tighten that at all. Battery connection screwed on again and we'll give it a test start. good. Now all I need to do is put the wheel back on and we are good to go. If you have any questions about the painted calipers or the LED light bar or the truck box, I will link each of those videos at the end of this one. Don't forget to like if this video helped you and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks a ton for watching.